Hi everyone, my name is Sushmita and I am an advisor at Unirali. In our previous video, we talked about letters of recommendation that are required when applying to the universities in the US. In this session, we are going to talk about financial aid and scholarships available at the US universities. There are three types of financial assistance available to the students applying to US universities. Number one, scholarships. Number two, financial aid. And number three, government grants. First, let's talk about scholarships. Scholarships are non-governmental aid given to exceptional students for academic excellence or extracurricular achievements. These are mostly offered by universities themselves. You may receive them if the university believes that you have a strong application and they want to retain you as their student. This type of scholarship may be awarded to you even if you haven't applied for it. Now, let's talk about financial aid. Financial aid is a need-based fund offered by US universities to students unable to pay the complete tuition fee. An applicant can apply for financial aid by filling out the CSS profile online. The CSS profile is administered by the College Scholarship Service, the Financial Aid Division of the College Board. This form allows universities to determine your eligibility for non-governmental financial aid. To know more, please visit the official College Board website. Remember that your application may be considered less competitive when you apply to a university with a requirement for need-based financial aid. For example, if there are two students with the same profile and test scores, with one applying for financial aid while the other doesn't, the universities would prefer the student not applying for the financial aid. This is why only ask for aid if you need it. There are some universities that offer need-blind financial aid. This means that all applicants would be held on the same scale regardless of their financial need. At need-blind universities, requesting financial aid does not reduce the chances of admission. One such university is Harvard. Now, let's talk about grants. Grants are federal aid offered by the US government. In order to receive federal grants, you have to fill a form called FAFSA, which stands for Free Application for Federal Student Aid. This application is administered by the American Department of Education. The FAFSA also gives students an option to apply for federal work study, which provides part-time jobs for students with financial aid, allowing them to earn money to help pay education expenses. You can find this free form on the FAFSA official website. International students are not eligible to receive this federal financial aid. However, many universities will ask you to fill the form as they require it for their own merit or need-based scholarship programs. This form allows universities to understand your financial position better. And this is why we would recommend that you fill out the FAFSA. Remember that every university has its own requirements and criteria. So make sure you check the official website for information on different types of financial aid offered. We hope that you found this video helpful. In the next video, we will be discussing the different types of deadlines offered by the universities in the US. So like, share and subscribe. If you happen to have any questions, please feel free to ask in the comment section below. Also, if you would like to know more about how to apply abroad, log on to www.unirali.com. Our counselors on the website will give you everything you need to go ahead. See you next time.